obviously kind of forgot to start recording, but at the moment I have some carrots, onions, and celery in here. I usually chop, I chopped up about four carrots, four small carrots, diced them up, and then um, started cooking them, a little bit of olive oil, for five or ten minutes or so just to get them started before I added the onions and the celery. So now I just added the onions and celery, a little bit of salt and pepper, season it to cook. Now it's just simmering this down just a little bit. And then once that's reduced down, I'm gonna add some beef base. And then I'm gonna add the ground turkey. We're doing this chili with ground turkey. Show them the beef base. Yeah, beef base. And then we've got chili beans. Oh, this is the onion. Chili powder. Diced tomatoes. Some more diced tomatoes. Oh, the wrong beef base. So there's about three cans of chili beans. Um, okay, that's the bouillon stuff. But um, yeah, we've had a busy morning because there's a a party later, and uh, and then we're making chili for tomorrow. Um, we have a couple of people over for when the trick or treaters come. Um, yeah, this is we've been busy. In fact, he started the chili. I didn't even know he was starting it. So, not much heat base left in here. That's all we really need just to get it started. Uh, wait a little bit. When I do it, I usually um, use the crock pot. And well, I usually do it like overnight or um, just let the crock pot do it during the day, whatever. Yeah, we do that sometimes too. Basically, I'm just starting this. I'm going to start the ground beef and then get the, or the ground turkey, excuse me, get it cooking. And then I'm going to throw it in the crock pot and simmer because we're walking out the door here shortly. So, just wanted to get everything started. And the ground turkey and. And I'm just going to let this cook here for a few minutes and then once it's nice and browned and cooked down a little bit then I'll transfer it to the crock pot with the tomato sauce and the chilies and the bean, well actually the beans go in a little bit later but so you can pause it right, So now I'm transferring everything to the crock pot. Mm, smells yummy. Smells like Thanksgiving dinner on that turkey. <laughs> I feel bloated just thinking about Thanksgiving. So I got the ground turkey, and as I mentioned before, I have the um, salt, pepper, beef base. I'm just gonna add in these beans and chili sauce, uh, diced tomatoes, green chilies. We use these a lot for a lot of things. They're pretty yummy. Yeah. Also going to add oh, another good helping of um, chili powder, just so that this stuff can simmer 
for a few hours and then we will check the flavor once it's ready. Whoa. Holy, what is that? Chili powder. Chili powder. And a little bit of garlic. garlic I think I guess we won't do garlic just a little bit there there should be a bigger bottle in the cabinet mm -hmm. hold on I'll pause this alright so we got a fresh jar of garlic butter Like garlic. In my opinion, you can't have too much garlic. Garlic cures a lot of things. Yeah. Garlic cured all diseases. I live forever. I even like garlic on my eggs. Wouldn't it be nice if garlic cured stupidity? <laughs> <laughs> I'd, be, I'd be serving that for so many. All right. Now we're just gonna let this simmer for a few, or for a low for a few hours, since we got things to do, and we'll come back later on in a couple hours and taste test it. I also want to take a break and do um, a quick shout out to our nephew Alex. He also has a YouTube channel, and it is called Alex Outdoors Adventures, and um, he's been keeping me company because as I'm cooking and making my video I'm watching his and um, you know if you're into reality TV um, nature uh, mountain climb and all that stuff definitely uh, give his channel a look um, how nice I mean he's young he's happy he's you know hands-on learning experience it's it's awesome and uh, well it doesn't matter what age you are I mean geez you could be 60, 70 years old and be in great shape and doing what you love. Whatever. It's awesome. So anyways, I'm going to put his exact link um, in my description and uh, give it a look. And I think he's also going to eventually put a, on his channel a donation link if you want to help him out. You know, get equipment, whatever. Um, feel free. But... Uh, so, yeah, I'll add that in the description. All right. Thanks. Oh, I forgot to turn it on. I, I had it paused so that you could hear me, but I wanted to turn it on for a minute. Um, it's actually accurate for the... I don't know if you how can... How well you see on the camera, that's pretty much how I'm seeing right now. So, still getting pretty dark. Yeah, you can't really it see him because of the glare on my TV. Right and but like I said, I'm I'll add the link. All right, so the chili's been in the crock pot for a couple of hours. Um, I added a little extra chili powder, a pinch of salt, um, just to test the flavor out. But uh, I think it tastes pretty good. And it's turkey chili. And over here, we already boiled up a little bit and get ready to have a nice little bowl.